Good morning. Today is, uh, honestly, I have no idea what today is, but I'm headed to BGC to meet some fellow American photographer. We're going to just hang out at Starbucks, chill, meet, talk, see what's going on in the Philippines. Uh, it is Sunday. Wow. Out here, I guess the days don't matter. I swear it's going to be a hot day. I have not even made it out of the hotel yet, and I'm already, like, sweating and shit. That looks like my Uber's almost here. What the hell is a Mahindra XY load? This is gonna be a fun one to find. It says one minute estimated time, but the car just keeps spinning in circles. It says it's here somewhere. I have no idea which side it's coming from. So look for a car that I have no idea what it is. I think that's the head right there. so clean now. A couple years ago, it was like, couldn't even see the water. There's so much garbage. I guess since Third Day became president, it's really picked up. It's become a lot nicer here. in the back. Hell, this might be better than getting the Everest. Uh, probably not better, but... Oh, well, maybe. That stitching, though, actually pretty freaking nice quality. I like it. And it's super comfortable. The seats. So that means a lot. You're in traffic a lot in the Philippines. Back end's pretty big. Full of water. <laughs> yeah, get some shit moved around. Off road. I guess I better go back to the meeting place. Tiki's probably sitting in the sun waiting for me. She's gonna kill me if she gets tan. Oh wow, look how she showed up. Gandana. Ah. Ah. Yeah, you, I like that outfit. That's cute. I like the outfit. That's cute. You don't want to stand in the sun with me? Come on. 
I need a tan. <laughs> yes, it is very hot. I'm out of touching distance. I'm standing in the sun. Had to go search and find an ashtray. Keep BGC beautiful and clean. So excited. Meeting new people. I'm nervous a little bit. I don't know. I'm weird about meeting new people. It's like out of my comfort zone. <laughs> but we've been talking for months. And Jinky looks so cute. Awesome, we found this place. I need cigarettes and there's mine right there. Cool, and I got the baby. That's awesome. My favorite pack is one with the baby. Jinky is making fun of me because the Philippines has stripped me of my gains. My arms are tiny now compared to before. I knew it because the way t-shirts fit and stuff, but it's nice she likes to remind me all the time that I don't have the muscle I had when I met her. Going to the Philippines, I was like, I'm dieting in hardcore. I'm gonna take the steps through twice a week, 35 floors. I'm gonna work out like every other day, hardcore, and be like ripped and shredded and huge. Man, I worked out twice since I got here. Twice, and I'm eating fast food and drinking pop again. So, the Philippines is bad for your gains. Bad for your gains. Too much to do. Too many excuses not to work out. And what long chicken breast. I cannot find boneless chicken breast Real here. I need grilled chicken. What long pair I call. Budget, budget. Jinka found the only poor Americano in the Philippines. $100 a week budget. <laughs> That's not a lot. Is that a lot? Okay. It's a lot. $100 a week is a lot in the well, Philippines. No. It's not true. Don't believe it. Well, you know, one day. <laughs> yeah, one day that would be good. I'd be happy with that. I've seen a YouTuber want to play the game Count the White People. So far in BGC, I've seen two. Delawa. And then me is Tutlo. White people. <laughs> you like that? Go stand in it. Running in BGC, but only under the rock. This girl never waits for me. I always got to keep an eye on her because if I stop for one second, she's gone. Gone again. Huh? Does not wait for me. There she is again, taking off. Oh, I see. She ran for the shade. Bucket, why are you over here? <laughs> So Genda, shit. And I like that you're like three foot five. I'm, I'm kidding, three foot ten. <laughs> <laughs> it is freaking hot out here. But we made it, Starbucks. It's gonna be a great picture, even though we're gonna be completely shadowed out. Phone again. Always the phone. Oh, by the way, I forgot to say, Starbucks in the Philippines does not have the blue raspberry energy drinks, and that totally sucks. So we left. I'll just go to Pancake House or something and get a Coke. Degree is not dead in the Philippines. He brought one Coke out. It said, ladies first, down. Ladies first. Oh. Woo. Me so first. Drink a fish. Drink fish. Yummy, Maserat. Bucket Maserat Pukimon. 
just kidding. <laughs> oh my god. Got mine now. Jinky's having problems drinking through a straw. Spilt her coke all over herself. Oh, because of what I said. Freaked out. <laughs> my god. Damn, Filipinos are so conservative. Can't even give them a compliment in public. All I said was... <laughs> She's waiting. Ah, look, another wife. I know. Put that. So that's... Uh, Appot. Four white people so far. Oh no, five. I seen some chick too. Five. Five. Five what? White people. Same to them. Oh. Plastic cow. Huh? Plastic cow. You. Oh, yeah, me. Plastic white? <laughs> <laughs> Plastic white. You know, I think before this day is over, she's going to end up killing me. I know that's how my end's going to come in the Philippines. It's going to be that one right there. Filipinos don't understand sarcasm. A warning to those of you traveling here. Very happy people, but they don't understand sarcasm and get offended extremely easily. You gotta work on them for a while and build it up. You can't just lay it out like we do in America. Okay, okay. This is the reason you can't get in shape in the Philippines. It's like 200 degrees out here, so you have to get stuff like this. Babe, you're gonna help me eat that, right? We gotta hurry, because look, it's already melting. It's been out here for like 10 seconds. I guess our count is now at seven. Seven white people in BGC so far. In the Philippines, they got rebel flags on their shirts. I wonder if anyone here even knows what that means. Nice. 100 pesos, it's two bucks. And we are in the rich part of the Philippines in BGC Mall. Or a mall in BGC. Yeah, 100 pesos. Shit. So yeah, if you shop right, stuff's really cheap here. I thought the Philippines is like super conservative. But there's a shirt that says bad bitch. So they don't look very conservative. Short shorts. Just finished our meeting with the American photographer and his assistant. We're headed home now and I think we're going to get back together tomorrow to try to discuss some business ventures, see what's going on. We'll meet at his studio, so that'd be fun to check that out. And I think Jinky's going to shoot, right? Are you shooting tomorrow? I think she's shooting tomorrow. She's acting shy.